Chai Owen agus agatar a hal lo kyo tradisionte, mudi gabe ikal nach bege madenach. Habili enya malers on a hain iskiel vachen agus a gyo evide asa harmonica. Amanti the chur na chanuiti loizre agus na termi altula marhal or hele ser liz. A vel dru. A vel dru. Yeah. I didn't know what you just said. There. I know. <laughs> just just a vel dru. A vel dru. A vel dru. Yeah. What does that mean? Just a smell or a mix up. Yeah, just yeah. Confused. Just confused. Just confused. Right. Yeah. Just confused. Yeah. Yeah. Well, say that one because I can mind. I can use that to you explain that myself. One. Say yeah. that again. <laughs> I'm just in a vel dru. I'm, I'm in a vel dru. Yeah. <laughs> can you use that for the rest of my trip? That's the rest of my trip. You're, you're, all, kind of, you're all kind of, the range of it, I know, you're mixed up. Love it. Describe for me the difference between Orcadian music in comparison to the other type of music in Scotland. What would you say sets it apart? I would say it's got a, sort of a soft rolling lilt to it. The way they play the tunes is quite different. Shetland have a sort of snap. But I think it's a thing of the people because when we go to Shetland, the people are far more in your face. You can are far more confident and upfront than Arcadians are more reserved. And I, I think you hear that in the music actually. Oh, that's lovely. So you're a soft, yeah. gentle form. Oh yeah, something like that. <laughs> that was very well described. <laughs> <laughs> I, I actually did that. Did you bring a song for us today? I could manage to do a song for you, yeah. Yeah. Butter on the bow. Butter on the bow. Butter on the bow, it's called. Yes. Yeah. And a true story in this man called Ali Winnick who was a great exponent of writing songs, and he always wanted to play his feather fiddle. So he took a dune off the wall, and you cane your fiddle, when you try to play a fiddle, terrible soon comes out of it. Screeching and squeaking, and what? nobody nice at all. Not if you're just carrying. No, no, I'm kidding. Not, not, I'm kidding. Not you know. but, but anyway, he decided that it was needing a bit of lubrication, so he just found a dish of butter in the kitchen. That's the secret. Took a lump of butter and rubbed it right down the bow of the fiddle. And of course, it made no sound at all, mm -hmm. ruined the bow. This folk came in, and of course, in the words of the song, I'm finished with the fiddle, and there's not the slightest doubt if I ever learn an instrument, it's got to be the flute. It's got to be the flute. <laughs> <laughs> when I first tried it, you know, I don't Summer, summer day, that they scribbled down the spindle where the old man's bow. In a twiddle day, the string and put the fiddle to each end. We're mine to keep the summer, so I thought to try a hem. But I got an awful streak, you know, I do a dum the diddle when they scribbled down the spindle where the old man's bow. No, the wee ginger cat dug it underneath the mat. Where do you do a dum-a-diddle? I don't know. 
funny place, such a tune that I could not set me doing. But it was mine they do the butter on the old man's bow. No, I'm finished with a fiddle, and there's no the slightest to it. If I ever learn an instrument, it's gone to be the flute. For when unk and folk come by and they mark the introductions, I'm the boy that part the butter on the old man's bow.